Tackling the course next is Amy Stevenson, who wants to be a ninja warrior for her two daughters, to show them that if you really want something, you need to get up off your butt and go get it for yourself. Put your hands together for Amy Stevenson. Now just takes a breath before she starts on the quintuple steps. She's got a hell of a story. Amy Stevenson, three years ago, she lost her brother. Not long after that, her marriage broke down and this inspired her to chase her dream job as a gymnastics coach. Why? Because she wanted to prove it to her daughters that if you really want something, you've got to grab a hold of it and never let go. You've got to take your time. There's no rush at this stage. Just get through the quintuple steps. And the course starts in a little bit harder. Yeah, she's grabbing a hold of something and not letting go, which is her strategy to life, but... Eesh. She's finding this difficult because she's only 161 centimetres tall, so that's on the shorter side of our competitors and 56 kilograms in weight. Gee, you know what? It's easy to think that just because this is the first obstacle, it's easy, but let's just remind everybody at home, they're 1.5 metres apart. Now just get up off the couch and step out 1.5 metres and do that five times. <laughs> Here she is, Amy Stevenson, taking on the rolling pin to bungee. Didn't find the quintuple steps particularly easy. But going for her, she's a gymnastic coach. She'll hang on for dear life and hopefully she can reach the bungee once she dismounts. Gymnastics background help her on the rolling pin to bungee. She's very petite, but she's very strong. Here we go. Grab that bungee. Oh. Yes, you did. That is a gymnastics move, I believe. Come okay. on. I said she's strong. What's going on with the bungee? She's How did she split do the bungee. That? I've never seen the bungee split. How did she do that? She's done the splits and then she split the bungee. She had foot surgery, then 12 years out of competition, and then won the Gladstone Masters competition. She goes to the Australian Masters Games this year. Now onto the Bridge of Blades, which I'm backing her to get through. The lighter, smaller competitors find this obstacle easier but what she does need is speed she likes to walk on her hands because she prefers life upside down don't want to be upside down here Amy oh just lost a little bit of momentum oh. 